love the rain. Check this out. Hella rainy. Oh, nice. Island rain. Preston, you should be. You should be running outside in the rain. <laughs> Why aren't you running out in the rain? I love it. What up, fam? It's six thirty in the morning. Um, so we just got a. Um, uh, bit of a news weather information from our host over here that the Mindanao area will have uh, is going through a storm today. Island hopping still on. However, it's going to be rough seas. So the earlier we leave, the better. We're um, we are waiting for everybody else because we are going to be in a group. Going to be in a group. But this is our view. Hey, Bill. So we're just waiting for the boat. We're going to ride. Took the van from the resort to the port, the jetty port. Yes, that's not a four-wheel drive van. So we were slipping and sliding in the mud. What if I guess? So we're getting the boat part situated. The uh, host is getting us a boat that would fit, I think, 11 people. How many people are there? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, like 13 or 14 people. So we could go. Island hopping, so it's gonna be rough seas, but with a bigger boat, I mean, with a bigger boat, it won't be as bad. But then again, <laughs> look, <laughs> look at mommy. <laughs> She's worried about the rough seas. <laughs> So we're riding the boat now. It's the green boat. I think the captain sits there. Wait, does the captain sit there? Oh. I don't know, this is maybe their seat. <laughs> We're debating if this, this is where the captain seats. Oh, no, I don't want to sit in the back. <laughs> We're going to head out to Tanque um, Lagoon first. And um, I don't think we're going to stop by Montreal. But uh, rough seas is ahead.
here at the uh, Tanke. There is a entrance fee of 20 pesos per head. What's your mom doing? Oh, she's getting food. It's low tide. So we'll see what we can find here. So of course you do picture, picture first. Picture. <laughs> That's the whole lagoon. It's low tide. So you see this beach area. And it's shallow. You guys wanna walk on the beach? On the beach? In the lagoon? That's fine, your crocs are big. You guys wanna go to the lagoon? Yes. So you gotta watch your step on this. Sharp rocks. Sharp rocks! Yeah, if we could only have it. Preston got this. Are we on the wrong side? I don't know. Go down that way, Danielle. What? Go down there. Uh, no, are we on the wrong side? Through, this way. Okay. This is so cool. Check this out. This little cave right here. It's so quiet here. So water usually goes up to that water line right there if it's high tide. But right now it's low tide so it's like waist high or knee high. Pretty warm. On this part of the Isla de Gigantes tour, you have to um, pay 20 pesos to get in per head. Um, preferably do it in the morning because there's not that much people. Because according to the captain, the boat captain, that once it's um, around like noon or late in the day there's gonna be so much people here and um, they tend to hurry up everybody so people could take turns in this lagoon but it is beautiful out here and at times you could see fishes swimming around here as well see how clear that water is when it's high tide this is like blue So heading back, we're going to go to Antonoya Island. You want to sit right there? This is where the waves went.
in Antonia Island. We're gonna go eat have because some I'm hungry. Breakfast over here. Is there a no shell policy? No taking shell policy. Wow, it's such a peaceful oh, island. Yung lunch kayo na. Oo. Yeah. Ano na lang kayo nung Andun ba ma, mamaya pag may oo, okay. swimming Pwede. na lang kayo. Tapos may snorkeling area kami diyan. Oh, gusto niyo mag fish feeding or mag coral reefing. Sa diyan po. Oh. May mga yeah. gear kami sa tindahan na pinaparinig. Tapos may kayak din kung gusto niyo mag -dance. I don't want to eat breakfast because we have a big lunch later. Oh, let me go get my uh, my drone. Mommy, I'm gonna put the weapon. To the sandbar we go. Preston's so excited about the sandbar. I'm very excited. I'm very excited. I've been wanting to go here. That's why when we came here, how many years ago, I was like telling them, you gotta go to Isla de Gigantes, and I ended up not going. Because I had to take pick, take, take, take care of stuff. Paperwork. Poor mommy. Poor mom. Her boat stuck. because she's a bad omen. It's Preston. It's Mana. She's a bad omen. I'm in Europe for rabbit. I'm good. I'm lang, Manan. I love you. It's like the soul all over again. The soul. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got we stuck, stuck in the middle of the damn water. Right. So this happened in the soul before, but a small boat. we had a small boat, <laughs> but that was more that's scarier because it was it was at the uh, <laughs> the middle of the sea, <laughs> and it was hella hot too. There wasn't the roof. Yeah, there was no. Yeah, but we'll see. Hopefully, we can go back to the soul again. Oh, no, it's raining. It's running again. I'm not sure if you can see that line right there where the blue part is. That's the deep end. It actually is a drop off right when you uh, go down there. So the captain is saying, don't go down there. So anyways, this uh, sandbar, this particular island right here, um, when you get to this island, they, re they uh, ask for donation doesn't matter how much there's no required amount so we just give them uh, what we gave the other one last time which is uh, 100 pesos uh, that makes it 20 pesos per head over here so at the uh, lookout area the Gamay Kabugao Gamay Island I think it's Kabugao Gamay Island if I remember um, the entrance over there, there's an entrance over there. It's 50 pesos per head. So. And they only take cash, no credit cards, no G cash, as far as we know. We're also gonna go to the Gamay Island over there, where the famous um, lookout is. 
that you guys that you guys see in our uh, intro. Damn, it's a lot of people here. So this is the famous Kabugao Island where you take a picture right up on top right there. That's what you see in our intro video. So we'll see if we could kind of redo it with mommy this time. But there's so much people. Look at that. When we left, when we came here last time, it wasn't, it wasn't that crowded. Still waiting in line. So close yet so far. Mom, mommy, since this line isn't moving, I'm gonna tell you a, a joke. Okay, I'm gonna tell you a joke since this line isn't moving. What? They should make a mind-controlled candle. You know why? Why? It makes sense when you think about it. <laughs> so we finally made it up here, but now we just gotta wait. Isn't that right, Mom? Mm -hmm. It's bright. It's not even that bright. Look. Tell me, guys, in the comments. It's just bright to you. Uh, no, I'm not, Monon. Can't you see? I'm. Oh, it's our boat next. And this picture taking. So. They did visit their family. And Legit Preston forgot my shirt. Forgot his shirt. <laughs> In the boat. Again. Christmas cards. Yeah. These are OSHA approved stairs. They're very high quality. Yes, we are back on the ground again. Let's go. We're finally here. Finally back. We made it. We made it. it took a while to get, get up there. Anything else about slip? Yep. <laughs> you should have seen it. It's like a lot of water. Oh, yeah. I want to just stay here. That's what we did. We stayed here the longest, huh? Hi, Danielle. We stayed here the longest. Until somebody came Until in, Baywatch, Baywatch came, in. came in. So we are in Mini Boracay. We call it Mini Boracay because the water and the sand, it's the same as Boracay. Bring some sand to your house. Not a 100% guarantee. 